transferring lines, polylines, multilines for layouts and working in oral coordinate system. So the workflow for this would be to first set the Z value. We're going to set the set Z value to the center Z of the layout. This is 5.6. And once this is done, we can choose the line tool, then press enter, then new window will appear. We want to work in the world corner system and use lines. Again, by picking two points on each line, we are going to transfer the information to ZWCAD. Now we created lines. At the end, click on finish intersect and then all the lines will be connected. When we select them, we can see that the Z coordinates are correct. Then same applies when working with polylines also in the world coordinate system we would like to create polylines same workflow pick two points on each line and at the end again so here also as a tip um, when picking points we can click on ALT or uh, keep ALT pressed in order to snap at the point cloud. And now we also created polylines. Now the last option is create multiple lines, meaning um, yeah, that they don't have to be connected to each other. Then yeah, for that PC line, multiple lines and separate multiple lines can be transfers. So for example, for the lines in, in the middle of, the, of, the, of our layout of the building, can be transferred. However, the strength of the tool can be demonstrated even better when working with repetitive um, elements such as um, beams or wooden trusses, stuff like, like that, where we have to create multiple parallel lines of the specific elements this can be easily vectorized using multiple line tool. We can set another Z value if these are uh, going to be uh, at another elevation. And then by working with multiple lines in world coordinate system, we can transfer the coordinates of these elements very easily and very fast. So, yeah, as you can see, we set the Z at a specific value. However, there are other options available as well when transferring the coordinates using the multiple line tool. Um, either this one by fixing locking axis or actually transfer the real coordinates of the, uh, of the picked points. But this will result in a 3D line. So when, um, when we are going to look at it from the front view, for example, they won't be at the same level, but they will be on, on different heights.